In this video, in this video, I'll be introducing two new laws. In this video, I'll be introducing two more algebraic laws of logic: the law of complements and the law of involution. We start by examining our primitive proposition p. We know that p either is true or false. If we look at the negation of p, which is read as not p, then we know that uh, p is false and true because not p is defined as uh, when p is true, not p is false, and when p is false, not p is true. So the law of involution tells us that if we have a proposition and we feed it through a function twice, we'll end up in the same spot. So if we have uh, proposition p starting at state 0, feed it through a function, the negation function, it'll bring us to state 1 as not p. If we feed not p through the function, it'll bring us back to state 0, which is p, or known as not not p. So uh, p is logically equivalent to not not p. That's what involution tells us. We then analyze the law of complements, which tells us that the uh, disjunction of p and its negation, not p, will be the logical equivalent of the true value. So it is, a, it is known as a tautology. It is always true. Uh, and that's the corresponding truth table here. It also tells us that uh, a proposition and the conjunction of its negation is always false, which is known as a fallacy. So you can go through this truth table and you'll see that we have a tautology, fallacy, tautology, tautology, fallacy, and fallacy. And we'll talk more about these in later videos.